Hey, uh, another Sunday afternoon, getting ready to leave the property. I uh, thought I'd just do a quick video, show everybody what uh, what happened this weekend. Uh, mostly for family and friends. Um, if you're new to the channel, uh, I'm just going to walk around the property. So if you want to see a, our little slice of heaven, then go ahead and follow along. Uh, this property was started by my mother and stepfather, and it's grown over the years. So anyway, let's start over here. Uh, I've added a little bit to Derek's uh, <clears throat> wood store. What, what do you call this? A wood house? I don't know. <laughs> anyway, I, I made it so that the tarp is angled, and it should uh, it should keep the rain off. But we'll see. Um, so, it's been a pretty productive weekend. We got a lot done, uh, especially in the garden. I'll show you guys that in a minute. Um, next weekend, I plan on going across the creek and getting all that trimmed out. I was going to do it this weekend, but we ran out of time. Uh, got this hosta. That we need to get in the ground so we're going to expand this little rock garden plant it right where it's at expand it around maybe i'll even bring it around closer to the steps there and, and put some more flowers and stuff in i don't know i don't know i never did get to my flagpole either uh so i just uh put some uh cement blocks in so here we got uh well, I know they're impatient, but she's also got some other plants in here. I'm not sure what they are, but Deb planted them this weekend, and then I mulched. Uh, except for the very end here, I think that's a Rosa Sharon. And she hasn't decided whether or not she wants to put it there or not. So, right now, uh, it's just going to sit there. <laughs> so, yeah, they, they look good. Looks really nice with the mulch. And uh, they always look nice once they grow up. So let's continue on here. What else we got to show you? Um, I'll take you around back over here. Uh, took all the bricks out of that were on the side of the house there. House, cabin. Um, and I took them over here. I didn't have quite enough to do all of them. But I put them around some of these roses Sharon we planted a couple weeks ago they're doing really good by the way uh, some of them are like three times higher than when we planted them but anyway with the bricks around like I got you can see here um, it'll keep me from weed whacking them down while they're so small like this until they establish themselves and I was able to do like eight of them, seven or eight of, eight of them, you know. And you can see I still got one, two, three, four, five to go. So I'm going to need 20 more bricks. And uh, you can see the deer like to lay here. I should put a trail cam over here. Okay, so remember that big mountain of grass? For those of you that follow me, uh, it came in really handy this weekend. Let me see, I got uh, three bricks holding the flag in place right now. I cannot find my post leveler anywhere. The thing's neon orange. It's always been there where I keep it, and it's just gone. I don't know what happened to it. Okay, so... Deb watered this garlic down and then we took the grass clippings or she took the grass clippings I should say and put it on top because it's supposed to get really dry and really hot over the next several days so you can see we got the onions covered pretty much these onions as well and the tomatoes 
Uh, so we got the strawberry patch in. Yeah. So we got strawberries going there. And then uh, in here we have. Ah, uh, damn it, we went over this and now I can't remember. Let me start down here. So I know she's got a gourd. Like right there, a pumpkin in the middle, and then another gourd, and then some short um, sunflowers. Here she's got some tomatoes, uh, zucchini, and then the other red steaks there. Uh, you can see these, I think that's a zucchini there. And, uh, and, um, Red steak there, I think, is uh, summer squash, but I'm not sure what's over here. I really can't remember. Anyway, everything's cut. Oh, and then she also planted some beans. She also did get some beans in. So, and then I moved this uh, this box over here. Eventually, I'm going to dig that corner out, and I don't know what she plans on planting there, but that's where that's going to. That's its new home. Uh, yeah, so the grass came in real handy, and that was I thought it was going to be all clumpy and nasty uh, Where this tarp is There's nothing planted and we just wanted to keep the soil moist moist But there was a piece of cardboard there and Deb lifted it up and there was a beehive underneath so I had to go and get uh, Get some uh, a Wheelbarrow full of soil and dump it in there. I also put rock over here where the damn groundhog had a hole in their thing and then he has a hole here that I filled with rock that's pretty much it guys uh, it's just a gorgeous weekend pretty hot today but yesterday was beautiful um, so we're gonna be heading out and uh, heading home here soon always the worst part of the week so, thanks for uh, watching the videos and uh, till next time we'll catch you on the flip side <laughs>